a beautiful stitch. Look at that. It's it's called, and I know but because I looked it up in the book, it's called ribs stitch. So it's very pretty. If you make it with bigger needles and thinner yarn, it can be considered a lace stitch. So, but you can use thicker yarn, you can... It looks like columns, huh? Yes. But this is, this is a number four knitting needle and this is a number eight knitting yarn, which is what the yarn calls for. And this is a stitch that is a multiple of three. So it's the same, it's a one row repeat, no problem with that. You repeat the same row over and over and you start with the stitch all the way from the beginning, all the way from row number one, and it's only that one row. So you're going to knit one, yarn over, and knit two together. And that's it. Knit one, yarn over, knit two together. 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 I have 21 stitches here. So knit one, yarn over, knit two together. It's a multiple of three. So knit one, yarn over, knit two together. And that's it. And you do that every row. And it looks the same on both sides. So this is very nice if you want to make, we're going to make a pattern that's called sleeves. So we're going to have it online very soon. This is, this is a very nice stitch to use with that or with any rug or with a shawl, a prayer shawl. That will look very, very pretty on a prayer shawl, but this is it. So thank you very much for watching. Please subscribe to our channel. We love subscribers. And, uh, and please like us and share us with your friends. And thank you very much for watching. Mm -hmm.